Kate, William and the kids run through the mall to get ready for trooping the color. Prince William and Kate, the Prince and Princess of Wales, are among the senior members of the royal family taking part in the Trooping the Colour parade. The Prince and Princess of Wales were seen arriving at Buckingham Palace with their children. Kate wore a stunning lime green dress with a matching hat, a colour likely an homage to the Irish Guards, of which she is a colonel. On the other hand, and Prince William wore the uniform of the Welsh Guards. Prince George was seen seated between his parents, who appeared to be an adult in a suit. The head of little Prince Louis could be seen behind the screen. Princess Charlotte has not been seen but is most likely with the rest of her family. William and Kate take George to King Charles's first Trooping the Colour show. Kate arrives with her son George at King Charles's first Trooping the Colour show. First Trooping the Colour fashion show. The event, postponed to today due to last month's poor weather, will celebrate Charles' birthday. The royals pulled up outside Buckingham Palace this morning surrounded by security guards. Prince William wore an army uniform and his Royal Air Force medals, while Kate looked stunning in an emerald green dress and matching hat. The Princess of Wales bowed gently to Princess Diana while wearing earrings. Prince George and Prince Louis looked dapper in their identical navy suits and red ties. Cheeky Charlotte and Louis smiled at fans who lined up along the mall. King Charles is the first monarch in 37 years to set off in the procession. Beside him were the Prince of Wales, the Princess Royal and the Duke of Edinburgh. When the clock struck 11, Charles was greeted before the national anthem was played. It is understood that Harry and Meghan will not be present. 70 military aircraft, including RAF Red Arrows, will take to the air in a massive flyby on Saturday. Trooping the color at Buckingham Palace features Spitfires, Typhoons, Chinooks, Apaches and a host of other military aircraft flying over 13 counties. The flight is expected to last around 15 minutes and officially departs London at 1 p.m. The Red Arrows are expected to gather in the North Sea region and set off around 11.45 a.m. to begin their domestic route through Lincolnshire. They then head to London near Hainault Country Park in Essex at around 12.40 p.m. and to Buckingham Palace from 1 p.m. The red arrows begin to dissipate at the end of the hover. Thank you for watching. Do share your thoughts in the comments section.